Job, Job, chapter 21, verse 20. His eyes shall see his destruction, and he shall drink of the wrath of the Almighty. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashim, Kakwadash. The Wadi Yabashim Yahushah for giving us the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone deserve double honors, rightfully so. And shout out to the Aki and pushing the word in sincerity and truth from being faith based and being prepared for what is to come. And what is to come? Race wars, concentration camps, famine, the RFID chip, which is the mark of the beast, thermal nuclear fire, 200 million missiles hitting the soils of America and several other places. And the rest of those missiles that don't be used will be destroyed. And there will be no more wars. After World War Three, Which is to come. Um, yeah, I just, you know. Saw this picture. And I thought to myself. This is, this is going to be a hell of, this is going to be a hell of a, uh, a way to go out. And you know, Ashashua is still going. The so-called white man is still going to have pride, cause they just fucking they just they despicable. They gonna think it's them. They gonna, you know, in that time to come, they gonna you know they're gonna be fighting to have my son Ashash in the Valley of Jehovah's vet. And and they gonna still thus fight, cause they got pride. So they're gonna be destroyed. But this right here. This is gonna it's gonna take out the whole soils of America. Rightfully so. This is your cup, Ashashua, aka the so called white man. And and the rest of the two thirds of the rest of the nation is gonna be caught up in the soils of America. You know? That's what's coming. It's gonna be beautiful. Alright. Psalms chapter 11, verse 6. Upon the wicked he shall rain snares and snares, fire and brimstone, and an horrible tempest. This shall be the portion of their cup. This is going to be a nice big cup for you, bro. Damn devil. Rightfully so, man. All the shit, you, all the wicked things you did on the planet Earth, the Earth don't like you. You don't, you, you y'all don't like each other. The rest of the nation is waiting to, to get the seat. But it's all about, it's all about controlling Yahweh Shem Al Shah, the best nation on the planet Earth that was given to, that was, that was um, that's supposed to govern the righteous, with the, the righteousness, with righteousness. You know. You know? So you're in a way of righteousness, so the Lord got to give you this cup. He's going to pour it out, and there ain't going to be nothing you can do about it. And you're going to enjoy it. You're going to enjoy it with torment. Rightfully so. Alright? You're going to enjoy it. You're going to enjoy the hardship, the slavery that comes with this. After this, you're going to enjoy every bit of it. Every cup that we enjoy, you're going to enjoy it. For that thousand years, I um, so-called white man. Psalms, chapter 75, verse 8. For in the hand of the Abba Shemel Shah, there is a cup. And the wine is red. It is full of... It is full of mixture, and the, and he poureth, and he poureth out of the same, but the drags thereof, all the wicked of the earth shall wig them out and drink them. That's hardcore slavery. That's the nukes, the slavery, 
We're going to take terror on you. Yes, this cup's for you. Beautiful. Verse 9. But I will declare forever. And I will sing praise to the power of, of Jacob. That's right. And that's what we're doing. Right now, this song that's being sang is to Yahweh Shah. He loved it. He loves it. He loves it. He loves to see us do this song. You know, go out there on the highways and byways and we do what we do for him. He loves it. You, know? you gotta do it like the apostles, baby. And you know, you know, being a young man, I mean, you know, coming into this and you know, they still number one. They're the number one um, the, um, singers for Yahweh Shah. That's why it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, this song is beautiful. Because all the stuff that we've been through, now we understand why. The Lord's going to have, he's going to make us, um, he's going to glorify us in the, in the presence of these wicked people, the two thirds. The, the rest of the nations and Asha Ashua, like the so called white man. The Wadi Abashi Mel Shah. Because we took a cup, but the two thirds is going to be put into this cup too. But the one third is gonna be out of it. You know, we, we, we happy. Huh? You know, we still getting gut. And who the fuck got time to be in this world, man? You know, you gotta do your daily duties. But I hate this place, bro. Huh? Why do y'all watch me out, y'all? For getting, um, for having this opportunity. You know? Why do y'all watch me outside? It's like I was um, looking for this verse. I thought it was with the, with the stack right here. I thought I wrote it down. Um, let's go back. Cause man, I, I I'm so happy I learned this. All right, all right, I'm just gonna read this one, and bring this home. We're bringing home with this, these two verses here. Okay, um, so I'm going to read these two verses in Abraham This was edifying and build you up, keep you in tune to the spirit of Hashem Shah. This is Isaiah chapter 51, verse 21. Thus say the Lord Yahweh Hashem Shah, and thy power that pleadeth the cause of his people. Behold, I have taken out of thy hand. The cup of trembling, even the dregs of the cup of my fury, thou shalt no more drink 
it again. And this is gonna come soon because uh, we still we still got the low drags of, of what's left of residue and all that. Because uh, people get go, you know, our people get gunned down the street, bro. But it's gonna be all changed for the better. Cause this world, this fucking world is for the worst, man. Verse 23. But I will put it into the hands of them that afflict thee. See? Which have said to thy soul, Bow down that we may go over. And thou hast laid thy body as the ground. We are like the basis of, the, of this fucking world. But it's over. All right, we're gonna be on top after they drink this little, this big old cup right here. It's a big portion, baby. After you get it, it gonna be nothing left for you. All right. I got one more verse, matter of fact. All right, um, it says, "And thou hast laid down thy body as the ground, and as the street, to them." that went over yeah so yeah there's all these man all these murders man is in the hands is is you know it's all spiritual but it's under their jurisdiction and they're the ones that's, that's, that got us in slavery so we're gonna be out of here man the lord ain't gonna keep us here no more which is beautiful all right another verse right here all right, I'm gonna bring it home with this one because this go perfect with this. Uh, do matter of fact, two verses. All right, we got um, Real Re Re Revelation chapter 14, verse 9. And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast and his image and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same should drink, the same should drink. Of the wine of the wrath of Yahweh by Shemelsa, which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation. And it's going to overflow. He it says it's going to overflow. <laughs> this cup is going to flow. It's going to cook America, man. And he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of of the holy angels and in the presence of the lamb which is Yahweh, which is Yahweh Shah. all right so uh this this cup's for you so called white man by Shashua Adawam Edom this cup's for you I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh Shemel Shah the Wadi Yahweh Shemel Shah forgiveness the apostles and the elders of great millstone Shalom to the Akiyah Shalom.